Good morning, Northfield Mount Hermon folks. This is Ellen Turner, confessed paper queen, and sometimes Luddite, call, uh, checking in to let you know how easy it is to read your files electronically. I'm somebody who loves paper. Take a look. I file everything. I love things in their files. I love to find them in their files. It makes it easy for me. But this year, I'm living in Ohio and the files are in Massachusetts. That means that in order to write citations, I had to read my files electronically. I thought, oh God, this is going to be terrible. And it wasn't at all. In fact, it was very easy. Um, I used my laptop and the advantages of the laptop are that I can really read it from anywhere. I'm never losing a file. Files aren't getting lost because they've been mailed. I don't have to wait for somebody else to, to finish with a file. I can have access to it anytime I want. So for you, who's going to be reading files, I can see incredible freedom because you're not reading behind somebody. You don't have to wait for somebody to return those files. A portal becomes your best friend. It's easy to access portal. And actually, come in a little close so you can see. This is a portal screen, and I've chosen Fiona Tierney. Don't tell her that I did it, but it was easy because I know who she is. This is what the screen looks like once you pull it up in Portal, and the Find button becomes your best friend because this is how you can change your record for whomever you're looking for. So we can go from Fiona Tierney to Althea Tierney. Oops, you have to spell their name right, though. And all of a sudden, Althea pops up. I generally read the interview notes first. I go to interview, click on that, and then you go to the interview report. Easy to read what was here, written by the, uh, the, the admissions officer who interviewed her. And then I go to the documents. In the documents, you have the A form, the B form, the counselor form, the actual C form, which is the application, an English recommendation, math recommendation, the transcripts, it's very easy to read through all of these things, and it made my job much easier. It kept it in order. I could go back to it. Now, I still use paper. I use my paper for notes. I wrote, I believe, over, um, uh, blah, 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 blah. I'm not exactly sure how many citations I wrote this year, but it was a significant number. And I still take my notes on paper while I'm reading, and then I write my citation from my notes. But I can always go back and look at a file if I didn't like what I wrote. So that's for citation reading. I would assume that if you're reading a file you might do it the same way, especially if you love paper. You might take your notes here before you write down or before you record your notes um, as a reader. I would imagine that a, uh, two screens would be helpful because you could read on screen and then you could do your recording on uh, another screen and that might make it work much easier for you. Um, my, since my work was specifically writing citations, it was a little different and I used paper as my friend. But the advantages to being able to read on a computer are thus. You can read anywhere. You don't have to remember to go pick up your files. Your files are always available to you. There's no losing of papers. The dog can't pee or chew on a paper. You can't lose the file. You always have it accessible. So I'm sold. I think electronic is the way to go. Miss you guys. Bye-bye.